oxytocin and arginine vasopressin, also known as ADH, the antidiuretic hormone, have a lot in common. They are duplicates of an ancestral gene, and so they share sequences in common. They are nine amino acids long, these neuropeptides, and many of the amino acid positions are the same. They are located in the same region of chromosome 20, P13. And these neuropeptides are primarily expressed in two nuclei of the hypothalamus. The paraventricular nuclei produce oxytocin primarily, but also vasopressin to a lesser degree. They have large magnocellular neurons, which uh, transport uh, oxytocin and uh, ADH, uh, to the posterior pituitary, in addition to smaller parvocellular neurons, which uh, can transport oxytocin to other regions of the brainstem and spinal cord. The supraoptic nucleus, which is just above the place where the optic nerves cross at the optic chiasma, produces vasopressin and to a lesser extent oxytocin, and also has magnocellular neurons transporting uh, the uh, neuropeptides to the posterior pituitary. Once they are released into the blood there, they then circulate as hormones. Both of these neuropeptides are produced in the soma of the magnocellular neurons of the nuclei of the hypothalamus. But while they are being transported along the axons, they are cleaved from the large precursor molecules to produce oxytocin and the other half of the precursor, neurofysin 1, or uh, vasopressin and the other half of the precursor molecule, neurofysin 2, in addition to a glycoprotein copeptin. These uh, neuropeptides with the neurofysins are then packaged in vesicles in the synaptic knobs and released into the blood as hormones. Both of these neuropeptides have cysteine amino acids in the first and sixth sites in the nine amino acid peptide. And these cysteine amino acids then form a disulfide bond, which give these neuropeptides their shape. Its primary function, and why it is known as the antidiuretic hormone, is that after renin is released in response to falling blood pressure or blood volume, renin causes the production of ADH, which then causes the production of water channels along the distal convoluted tubule of nephrons, which causes more water to be reabsorbed. Thus, when ADH is made, urine is concentrated, and this saves water. Although this is a major function of uh, arginine uh, vasopressin or ADH, uh, it also has many other effects. Uh, it's important in the stress response. It's involved in memory formation, in aggression and in a number of things normally associated associate with oxytocin, such as pair bonding and um, parental care. Uh, this may be in part because the receptors for uh, oxytocin and vasopressin are referred to as being promiscuous in that each can bind the other to some degree, and so therefore there is a little overlap in their function. Oxytocin, for example, can cause some concentration of urine. Oxytocin also has a number of roles. It is linked to functions involving appetite. Its reduction or interference in the production of oxytocin may be a factor in autism. Uh, that being said, the major functions of oxytocin revolve around reproduction. It is the main signal in orgasm. Oxytocin is the signal to the smooth muscle of the myometrium of the uterus to contract during labor, which is why synthetic forms of oxytocin like pitocin can be used to induce labor. And it is uh, the hormone responsible for the ejection of milk or a milk letdown during lactation. 
So while versions of oxytocin exist in more primitive uh, organisms because uh, these hormones have multiple roles. They are clearly very important to mammals given that the ejection of milk and the contraction of uterine muscle for live birth are some defining features of mammals and the placental mammals.